Hey, what up, decisive marketers? Today I'm going to be talking about brain cert, and I'm very excited about this LMS because it's been a while since we've come across a very powerful LMS, and uh, this company behind it, right, uh, brain cert, they have been in the enterprise sales for the past nine years, and they are now getting into the retail customers. Um, so we are actually getting. Uh, we actually get to try out BrainCert uh, as a retail consumer, right? So we are going to be testing out uh, BrainCert today, but before I dive into it, be sure to hit that subscribe button if you'd like to see more digital marketing and e-commerce content. Here we go. So here we are in BrainCert. Uh, so this is the admin dashboard right here. There are, uh, you know, there's a couple of different dashboards right here so this is for the super admin where i guess you get the entire uh, sort of uh, what's happening in there and then you have the uh, e-commerce so um so the the cool thing about brain Cert is that you actually have an e-commerce store you can sell physical products in there so that's the cool thing so you know maybe you're selling like pants or you know stationaries or whatever it is could be i'm not sure maybe you can even sell tablets or laptops you know to for learning you know uh, that could be something as well you have the instructor right here for the uh, trainer or you know the uh, course instructor uh you know dashboard and then you have the learners dashboard as well okay right and then so before we jump into the rest uh you want to go into the global settings there's quite a bit of things uh in brain so they actually have a ton of features and uh it i would say that it is possibly the most powerful Two that I have actually, uh, you know, in terms of elements wise, it's the most powerful uh, tool that I have actually come across in terms of feature set. And um, you can see that, of course, uh, the, the back end dashboard is a little old looking, right? But I'm going to show you the design that they have. Okay, um, my bad. I think I have to open up in the private window so this is how it looks like right it, it has very good looking design for you know your your site you know that's how it looks like right? great looking site and i'm going to show you some of the templates as well later it looks amazing so this is your website settings the site name you can change that the site description your logos right the time zone you can set that up as well i'm going to put in uh you know singapore right now okay and then you can set up your landing page okay so what happens is that when you view the home page um, that's what you see just now but you can actually change that right so you can change to let's say the login page so this is actually very good because uh brain cert has a ton of features built in uh so for example when i built my course on spay um i actually i still want to use my own wordpress website but i just wanted to use spay for the lms so i could do that with brain Cert as well by hiding the you know the home page you know um, hiding some of these uh pages that is not needed and just send them over to the login page right so uh so i can actually change it to the login page as the landing page and then uh, security wise do you want to allow concurrent logins from the same account so this is good so that when someone purchases a course they are actually not sharing that with other people so this is where this is useful and then uh you can also force uh you force ssl definitely you want to have that and then you can also enable uh the catalog settings i guess this would be allowing them to access the other uh catalogs you know purchase your other products in there as well and then you can also set up the virtual classroom so the cool thing about brain Cert, which i will kind of show you later on for the virtual classroom is that you don't have to use zoom 
uh, you don't have to use something else because they have it built in to brain cert itself and uh, they have some very nice features uh, let me just kind of mute some of this here okay so you have the student dashboard as well the uh, redirect uh, URL after they log out the language settings so you, you can um, sort of change that as well and then uh, they have a lot of custom apps uh, they call it uh, extensions right here so you can add a calendar to uh, so they have native apps and uh, like third party apps right here so uh, other tools can uh, other developers can actually build apps in BrainCert itself right so uh, you can enable a calendar you can see what are the events that's coming up right so you should then see calendar right here right so you can add events and stuff like that and then you can add single side on right you can turn that on if you want to and then you can have like for example gamification you can turn that on if you want to have a gdpr notice right you can turn that on um so they have uh zapier integration as well at the moment they don't have uh webhooks and api or public connect or you know other uh, integration platforms uh, integrated yet only zapier right so i would say that uh the the the, the founder did get back to me so uh they will be releasing that in the first uh quarter of the year so you know uh we will then be able to use uh, other platforms other than zapier so uh, you know although zapier is very powerful it is um it is costly right so just in case uh you know you are looking for something that is uh more affordable then you can go for for example public connect okay so next we have uh, google analytics you can turn that on and so on mailchimp and all that right zoho crm talk uh, all this can be added into their uh, brain set itself you can change the theme right here right you can change the theme so uh, you can modify the uh, dashboard if you want to the virtual classroom the uh, cost player the team uh, test player okay then you, ca you can change all this up basically and uh, like e-commerce i think that is uh uh you know your paypal or stripe so you could gotta set up the integration for that okay <clears throat> you can set up forums as well okay if you want to set uh you know enable it right so then you have forums in here okay uh and then uh you know someone people can so it becomes like a community feature built in into uh brain cert as well right it's, you know just a lot of stuff in here uh and then you can set up your mail release uh, i think you can set up custom smtp in here so we're going to check that out a little bit so whether you want to use brain cert uh, built-in mail server if not you can set up your own custom smtp as well okay so the next thing would be you know your landing pages right so you can create uh landing pages as well so this one is you know already done for you the default one but we can check out other you know landing pages so we've got six right here and they all look you know very beautifully designed although they they could have more but i would say that this is already very good looking you know uh, and then you can just add it from there uh you know maybe let's grab this one right here and check out the page builder right and see how it works okay so we're just gonna call it test Right, so this video might be a little bit long because they have a ton of feature and I will try to go through when I uh, as much as I can but you know there's a lot of stuff 
Okay, so for example, I can add a new section. So they, they have a lot of blocks in here. So you can really create something uh, beautiful. You can add videos, you can add badges, uh, you know, things like that. Okay. Right. Let's see. Okay, so you can add you know a lot of stuff in here so i believe you can design something great with this and you can have it uh you know responsive as well so pretty much uh, a very amazing uh tool so far i would say uh and then you can set discounts coupons and all that okay next will be gamification you can set that up as well so gamification uh, you can turn it on, you can enable uh, rewards, you know. So maybe they win a coupon to, you know, offset other causes that you want to buy. Right, you can design badges, rewards. Right here, let's see if they have some nice templates already built in. That can help you to save a lot of time to set things up. Okay, so you have got the library, right? So you can add some of these badges in here and they look decent, I would say. So, quite a lot of uh, design in here, right? So you can just grab one of them and start designing and you're ready to go, right? And then rewards, so we can check that out as well. So this is great as well. Um, so what happens is that you can give a percentage of discount if they have achieved a certain amount of points uh, and then or achieve a certain number of badges, right? So you can make, you can encourage people to become better and then they, uh, you know, are more motivated and uh, get more discounts, right? So uh, you can have your online store right here. Uh, so you can create some products to sell, right? Your e-commerce store, okay? So you can set up like, you know, whether you want a flat rate or you want to charge by per product, right? And you can set up your store settings, where's the location, where's the pickup, uh, and things like that. You can set up discounts and, you know, order notification, uh, products, whatever it is. Uh, you can set up uh, your discount coupons as well. You know a lot of stuff in there okay then uh so i let me see what content is right okay so i believe this would be like like your files so you can upload like your csv file excel pdf uh, in here okay uh, you can add your HTML content, iframe, whatever is all that uh, for your courses in here. Then you can set up tests as well. So we can kind of check that out. Uh, the test feature, right, you can have a quiz and there is different, uh, you know, let me just uh, set that up a little bit. Let me see if there's some uh, template test that's already being set up. If not, we'll create one, right, okay. Okay, so let me just create this. Okay, so uh, okay, whether you show, I mean, these are some, uh, you know, like whether you want to show them the answer or not. So we just click next. Uh, what kind of what kind of test type is this? Okay, so once the test is created, you can go into options and then uh, set up the questions in here. So I would say that this is the downside, right? It's like the UI for this section is not very clear. Like people don't understand how to 
create questions so some people might take a little while to get used to the ui but uh you know once you know how to set it up it's very easy so there is a different you know multiple different kind of tests or question type there is fill in the blanks multiple choice multiple uh, true and false uh multiple uh, answers true and false drag and drop audio question video question free text essay so a lot of stuff in there right uh and then uh causes so let's check out causes first okay so i have already created a cause right here because we are going to go into the course materials and then that's where you set up the uh, design, right? Um, so we'll, we'll come back to this shortly. So so you start by adding like chapters, so like maybe module one at okay, and then within this module, you can then add the lesson, right? So lesson uh, introduction. Okay, you can add that. Okay. So now it's added. Then we are going to we are going to edit. We got going to add content into the the uh, the uh, class. So you then have to go into contents and then add the you know HTML content or iframe uh, over here. Then that will be the lesson. Okay, so let me just kind of see how it works right here. All right, so you can upload your videos in here. Right, and then it, it will then show up. Let me see if I can grab some files. Right, so this this is where you can kind of upload your files. So let me just grab a videos, one of these videos here. Maybe like a short one. My recent videos have been a little bit long, <laughs> so here we have like a nine a uh, ten minutes one that should be that should take doesn't take too much time to upload okay right so there we go right it's uploading right now it's quite fast we'll just uh we'll just probably wait a little while okay so once you upload uploaded the video so you they will host it for you right so the, that's the good thing about brain cert is that video hosting is included right so i i just think that this 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 uh this two uh brain set is going to end up being you know one of the best lms that i have ever reviewed so the best one in my opinion for any individual course uh individual course creators right the best one that i've come across is called spay but now i think that brain set could be the next one uh, once they have released API webhooks and mobile apps. So mobile apps is going to be included into your BrainCert uh, account as well, right? So that's uh, that's why I think that BrainCert is is great. Okay, um, uh, with Spay, they don't actually host your videos for you. You got to use something like Vadu TV and then embed it into Spay, which is you know a little additional work that you have to be do you have, you have to be doing so with uh you know brain set everything is all for you uh you know mobile apps are coming web hooks are coming so you know you have all you need i would say and this is way more than speed as well because you got e-commerce uh in there you have forums which is also included uh with speed it, it doesn't come with it right Okay, and then uh, you have calendars. You have, uh, you don't have to use Zoom as as well. You can use their virtual classroom, which is something that they built in for them, uh, built in for you, uh, right? And then you can also uh, block downloads, block 
printing, uh, you know, disable copies, uh, you know, things like that. Okay, let me just save this. Okay, so this would be the, uh, you know, the content URL. So what happens is that we can go back to causes and then we can add this as a lesson. Okay, so cost materials. So this is the video right here. Right, it's all uh, added in here, you know, and it's hey, what up too, right? Just look at look at it. Let me just refresh the page. Look at how fast the video plays. Hey, it's instant, right? So it doesn't have to buffer or whatever, you know. So that's a very good experience for your students, I would say. So let's say you want to add this, you just add this in. Right, and then uh, you can disable fast forward as well. So once you're done, uh, I don't think we even need to save. It should be added automatically, and then we can preview as a learner. So we can take a look at the course uh, over here. Okay, so this is uh, also the course page itself. Okay, so you know. A uh, lot of very nice. Uh, I would say you know the 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 design is 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 okay. It's 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 decent looking. You know all the information in there, uh, and then we can jump into the uh, module itself, and this is how it is, right? So I think it. it I mean I think it's it's good, right? And then you can add uh, more stuff, right? Like tests, uh, live class class recording whatever it is okay and then you can also drip content as well so that's uh, built in and then any any comments uh, will come in here as well so every uh, lesson would have uh, you know would have uh, you know you can see you can add notes as a learner you can see you know how it is right here you can switch around the lessons right very clean uh, it doesn't distract you at all as well right uh, and then if you create multiple causes you can uh, you, you can classify them into different categories and then you can create cost bundles so you can sell the causes at uh, one price for multiple causes so that's good as well okay and then uh, let's kind of take a look at the calendar over here so you can create your events in here and then it's going to inform all your uh, students that hey uh, this will be the class you know everyone please attend the class right okay so you can see all the you know your calendar in here you can add an event right so you can put in uh, and then the who's the attendees right so who's the staff the the title you know all that right so you can put, create your own event you can put in the banner as well okay and then uh, we're going to check out the live uh, classroom as well it is actually very nice uh, let me just kind of show you how it looks like uh, I was wondering if we can just kind of start a class without scheduling right so system tests okay so I guess we got to schedule one <laughs> And we can try and schedule one right now. Uh, so so the thing about uh, BrainSet, right, the virtual classroom, you don't have to use Zoom. It is built in, uh, you know, natively, right? I believe that they built this technology in here. So you can set that up, you know. And then uh, once you're done, schedule and continue. Uh, we're going to put today's date and schedule. right and then there's whiteboard built in as well right so you can launch 
and then you're jumping into the virtual classroom right now okay there you go right and then people can chat in here right you look at the interface right it's it's beautiful looking uh you can create some private chats as well and then this would be the virtual classroom can you see that so uh i mean the the whiteboard you can draw uh you know circles whatever shapes uh eraser you can start cleaning things up you can type stuff in here you can put emojis you know heart uh you know uh a pin toolbox okay so uh, and then you can clear everything as well, just like that. Uh, Wolfram Alpha, what's this? Okay, so like, let's try Singapore. <coughs> there is a you know number of requests in here. Right, so you can search for certain things in here, right? So, uh. It looks like some kind of database where it kind of gives you some status uh, statistics, right? It's kind of nice, uh, you know. And uh, this latex too. I'm not really sure what that is. Um, I guess it kind of. Uh, I think it helps you to like calculate stuff. Uh, you know, you can create multiple bots as well and switch between them. Uh, what else? You can create brick rooms as well so like once you're done you can just kind of go into another room everything is empty people just kind of chat in there right and then you have code editor as well so this is very good i mean you can use this um so 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 previously i actually reviewed a uh lms i don't even recall the name because i gotta look through my my uh channel again which is a very good uh, lms for teaching coding but you don't need that anymore because BrainCert has this. BrainCert has these uh, languages, right? C plus, C plus plus, uh, sorry, C, C plus plus, uh, CSS, HTML, everything. You know, all this are all in here. You can create multiple uh, pages. You know, I think this is possibly the most powerful LMS I've ever come across. Uh, I just have so much good things to say about it. Uh, you know, you can change the aspect ratio if you want to. You know, hide the chat so people can't chat. You know, lots of stuff in here, right? Too powerful, I would say. You know, too powerful, right? So you can leave room and join later, or you can uh close the class all uh as it is. Okay. Right, and then you can add coupons in here. Oh, sorry, this is the brain search website. Okay, you can just, and then uh, everything will be recorded as well. So <sighs> amazing. That's all I can say. Right, amazing too. Right. Uh, yeah, just just simply amazing. I guess that's all I have to share. You know, it's it's too powerful, <laughs> right? Uh, and I expected the video to run a little bit long as well, just like now. Uh, and I have not even gone deep into like the the online store features, because you know I I I just kind of trust that they have most of the stuff in there. So the only thing you know, BrainCert, I I could say that the LMS itself, as it is, it is very powerful, but. Uh, it does at, at the moment it doesn't integrate well with other tools uh, because they only have Zapier at the moment and then uh, they are also adding uh, a mobile app it's going to be provided uh, to all of us included in the account itself right so definitely I'll say that this is the best LMS so far the best uh, had, that has ever come across uh, you know uh, because all the LMS that's out there they either lack a mobile app they don't have web hooks uh, you know things like that uh, but BrainCert has everything that you need for uh, online courses you know gamification uh, you know even uh, e-commerce feature as well of course they do lack the API and web hooks but 
the you know they will be coming and as well as the mobile app so i would say that brainsert is likely to become the best lms around right so that's all i have to share about brainsert the video is a little bit long uh but i hope that anyone who's interested in brainsert please uh you know grab it the link is in the video description if you enjoyed this video do give me a thumbs up let me know what you think about brainsert in the comments below lastly if you know anyone who could benefit from brainsert please share this video with them right anyone who wants to create an online course this is just the most amazing tool uh they everyone should get it okay so that's all i have to share about brainsert i'll see you in my next video bye bye